Well, welcome to our All Souls service here at St John the Baptist in North Baddersley. This All Souls service uh, takes place every year and normally we would have invited all of you to come and join us in church to remember those whom we have loved and lost this year. But because of this year's restrictions, we are unable to meet together. But of course we still remember everybody who has been lost this year and in years gone by. And so today we have come to light a candle in the name of every person whose funeral has taken place in this past year. And of course we will also remember all of those whom we've loved and lost in years past. We meet today to remember those who we love but see no longer, and whose memories we cher cherish, to renew our trust and confidence in Christ and his promise to pray that together we may be one in him, through whom we offer our prayers and praises to the Father. We are who we are today because of those whose lives have touched ours God does not ask us to forget those we have known and loved. Our sadness is silver-lined with gratitude for the lives that have shaped us, for hands that have held us, for voices that have inspired us, for love that enriched our lives. Believing that those we remember today are held in God's gracious embrace, we trust that we will meet them again in a place where there will never be sad farewells. So we make our prayers for those who now belong to heaven. First in our private prayers, made in silence, then a spoken prayer to gather up all our thoughts. Blessed are you, Lord God, lover of our souls. You uphold us in life and sustain us in death. To you be praise and glory forever. For the darkness of this age is passing away, as Christ, the bright morning star, brings to the saints the light of life. As you give light to those in darkness, to those who walk in the shadow of death, so remember in your kingdom your faithful servants, that death may be for them the gate of unending fellowship with you, where you live and reign with your saints in perfect union of love, now and forever. Amen. And so a reading from the Holy Gospel. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Believe in God, Believe also in me. In my Father's house there are many dwelling places. If it were not so, would I have told you that I go to prepare a place for you? And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and will take you to myself, so that where I am, there you may be also, and you know the way to the place where I am going. Thomas said to him, Lord, we do not know where you are going. How can we know the way? Jesus said to him, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not let them be afraid. And so claiming God's promises in that gospel reading that there is a place for every one of us in his heavenly kingdom, we will now light a candle for each person who has died this year in these parishes and say their names. And so we remember Gerald Reed, Marjorie Dias, 
Ruth Pierce, Roy Coombs, Joan Grubb, Marjorie Eldridge, Anne Walton, Charles Russell, Alan Buick, Joan Collis, Hester Guy, Christine Shawley, Kenneth Legg, Zoe Smith, Brenda Bishop, Shirley Holden, Arthur Reynolds, Margaret Logan, Jean Williams, Anne Harrison, and Annette McCall. And we also remember Robert Parsons, Nicholas John Reynolds, Valerie Maybe, Bernard Blake, Una Caton, Frederick and Violet Rogers, Ina Joan Green, David Steveley, Betty Ings, Sally Sibley, Edward Thompson, Ida Smith, Nan Bach, Brenda Randall, Betty Tuard, Michael House, Bob Jerram, Edward Thompson, Lily McDevitt, Victor Grubb, Geoffrey Church, Winifred Church, Catherine Gardner, Norman James Head, Stella Madeline Stratton, and John Jones. And we also remember all those who have died who are unknown to us. Those who had no one to pray for them or to light a candle for. And we also think of those who we remember at this time of year. Those who have died maybe some years ago, but we still hold in our hearts. And for all of them, we light this candle. So holding all of those in our hearts and minds, lifting our hearts up to God and all our thoughts in them, we pray the prayer that Jesus taught us, the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Neither death nor life can separate us from the love of God in Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. May God's care and God's love surround you. God's promise bring peace 
to your hearts. God's justice bring all of us to a new heaven and a new earth. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be with you and all those whom you love, now and forever. Amen. Amen.